everybody. Welcome back to ALB's Uke Toots. I'm glad you're joining me again today. We are going to talk about strumming today. We're going to talk a little bit about picking, but mainly about strumming because I know when you start playing the uke, you don't know where to begin when it comes to strumming. So, pop quiz. Um, do you remember these two chords? We got the open chord. Do you remember what that is? If you said A minor seven, you are correct. And then we have the easiest chord in the world, which will be all our model chord today, which is the first string on the third fret. And that's a C. So if you got that, way to go. <laughs> but no pressure if you didn't, it's okay. Um, so what is strumming? Strumming is the sweeping of the forefinger or the thumb or the pick along the strings of an instrument. So that goes for a guitar, mandolin, anything really, banjo, um, dulcimer. But today we're talking about the ukulele. So I'll show you what I do. I use my thumb and forefinger and I just kind of keep my, I use my, I play with either my thumb or my, my forefinger. Now you don't have to have a nail to play the ukulele. You can have no nail. Um, it helps to have a little something there. I mean, you, you don't want to play with a, you know, a nub where you bit off your nail. But, um, but if you have too long of a nail, it is hard to press the frets, I will say. So I like to keep mine clipped just a little bit. Um, but, okay, so let's, let's talk. Let's talk about strumming. So this is my, you let your forefinger stick out a little bit from your, where your thumb is. And you use that if you really, if you need a little bit of power. If you don't need power, if you're doing a really gentle strum, you can just use your finger. So easy peasy, right? So let's start with the easiest strum in town, which is just a down stroke. Okay, simple as simple can be. So we're gonna play the C chord and we're gonna go down, 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 down. One, two, three. especially when you're learning chords, especially because you can slow it down and you probably won't lose the rhythm of it. So that's the easiest one. That's the simplest strumming pattern. They're called strumming patterns to um, use when you're first starting out. And then you can also do a straight down, up. So down, up, down, up. And when I come back up, I'm not like trying to flick every single string with my fingernail. I'm just gently going, you know, grazing the strings. If it's really, really hard to make noise and um, when you're just gently using your finger, you may want to look at what kind of strings you have. Um, also make sure you're really pressing on that C because if you don't press it all the way, then your string is not happy. And then you're just chunking. Chunking is when you, um, you gently touch, this is a sidebar, you don't need to know this for strumming, but sidebar, you gently touch the strings and you can create a rhythm, okay? Um, so that was me speeding up the down up. Rock out on the uke. Oh yeah, good job. Okay, now, this one's a little more complicated. So you may have to pause it, but I'm just gonna talk you through it first. So the counts are one, two, and, and four, and. Okay, so you're gonna go down, down, up, up, down, up, down. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. So it goes, it's, it's two doubles and one single, one set of singles. And the rhythm, I'm gonna go really slow, is down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up. That is called a calypso, or sometimes it's called an island strum. And you'll hear that on, well, a lot of the stuff that I play on the yuki, I will um, play the calypso or island strum, but it goes down, down, up, up, down, up, down. So let's do it really slowly together. 
I'm gonna do it a couple of times really slowly for you and then you can go back and watch it again. I'm not gonna do an hour long video of me playing slowly for you because you don't need that. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Down, down, up. watch that 50 times to get it but that's okay that's what it, that's what it takes sometimes so that's um, those are the main strumming patterns that I'm here to show you today and then I was also going to show you my favorite picking pattern which I use for more whimsical um, songs so So what I'm doing is I'm plucking or picking the fourth string, the second string, the third string, and the first. So it goes four, two, three, one. And it goes thumb, forefinger, thumb, forefinger. Once you get it, you can speed it up a little bit. Beautiful. Good job, you guys. Okay. One more that I'm going to show you, and this is what I play when I do the waltz, when I play any kind of a waltz thing. And it's, um, it's the second and third string played by both your thumb and forefinger at the same time. Right? And then the first and the fourth string at the same time. four time but there are more four four I feel out there so the waltz isn't quite as necessary but this is a fun way to kind of pluck a little differently and get a little it's like a different kind of sweet sound you know it's really sweet it makes me want to start singing a song I wrote how to like to go walking with me to a spot down by written down somewhere but I think I just played them correctly <laughs> so that's all I have today as far as picking and plucking goes but um, I hope that this helped feel free to go back and watch it a million times and pause it as much as you need to and there is no shame in having to do it a thousand times because that is what it takes the number one way to master the ukulele is daily ukulele and please subscribe so that you don't miss any of my future episodes of ALB's Uke Toots. And I will be back and I'll cover that song for y'all so that you can hear it. Hey, I'm back. I'm ready to do my little song for you. And I'm going to put the chords up so that you can play along if you want. Try to hide the fact
tomorrow. I gotta watch you go. Let me hear you say you wanna stay. If all we got is tonight, would you hold me tight? I couldn't sleep a wink by your side in a million years. But you'll keep me warm from the breeze of the shore. I got a secret. Y'all, don't forget your daily ukulele practice and don't be hard on yourselves. It takes time. Have fun. Most importantly of all, have fun.